Hi, this is William Higgins with WiMAX ATL, and today I'm going to talk about and show you the Cradle Point Technologies MBR1000. This is a 3G, 4G mobile broadband uh, wireless N router, so I know that's a mouthful, um, but it functions very similarly to a standard uh, wireless router that you would connect to your DSL or your cable modem connection at home and, and share that connection via um, Wi-Fi and or the ports on the back. But what makes this device and many of the Cradle Point devices unique is that they integrate in with 3G and 4G mobile broadband devices. And I'm going to get a little bit more up close and show you some of the physical features of the device now. And then the second part of this video will jump into the actual administration module, the web-based administration of the actual router. And we're going to show you firsthand what some of those features are like and some of the benefits that you can uh, provide with this particular router. So right off the bat, I just wanted to show you that we have the actual router right here. Uh, it's a nice uh, black finish, has uh, obviously standard uh, lights on the front with the different uh, indicators telling you, uh, I guess, different LAN ports, the WAN ports activation, things like that. Um, for this test, what I'm also using is my this is a clear home modem, an RSU unit. So this is receiving an actual clear WiMAX signal uh, over the air, and it's feeding the router via an actual Ethernet cable. And this particular test, I mean, I'm really kind of showing that this would be more of a hard-lined uh, Internet connection. And then actually over here on the left, I have an actual CMU300, which is a clear 3G, 4G USB modem and that is uh, actually attached to the router on one of the two USB ports on the actual router itself. So let me move this box out of the way and we can kind of show you behind the uh, back here. And as you can see, we have some fairly uh, standard, we get the power port. There's a little reset uh, hole in there. There's another USB port there there's the Ethernet WAN connection and then you have four LAN connections there's an on and off uh, hard button in the back and you have three antennas which is synonymous with the wireless end technology so again I'm gonna just kinda spin around this so you can sort of get an idea for the size and have some a bit of plastic wrap on the top and front that I haven't taken off Make sure I don't scratch it up it's a demo unit so anyway, so as I pan back, we're going to move into the actual web interface here in the second part of this video to show you a little bit more of the functionality and actually give you some hands-on and understand what kind of uh, functions that we can do with this that you can't do with a normal router. 